Hello, boys and girls. Today for our reading activity, we are going to listen to a story. And I'm going to start this in Zoom, but I'm not going to read the whole thing on Zoom. So your seesaw activity will be to listen and watch this video to listen to the story. And then you're going to draw to share what was interesting to you. Okay, so this was called Goodbye Summer, Hello Autumn. And guess what? We are in a new season called Autumn or Fall. Summer is coming to an, is, has come to an end, and there are lots of things that we can see in nature that change when it's a new season. So this book is all about the changes that happen when fall is coming. This character goes on a nature walk. And as she's on her nature walk, she sees lots of things in nature. So she sees animals and plants and she feels weather and she hears things. And I, your job is to pay attention to what she sees and hears and feels because those things are clues that fall or autumn is here. So let's notice this, these things that we can see all around us. And I bet you see some of these things outside too, because the seasons are changing and you might notice some of these things outside in nature as well. One really cool thing about this book is that the character says hello to something and then that thing says hello back to her and it tells her what it's doing now that fall is coming. Things are changing. So pay attention to what the animals and the plants are telling her about fall. Okay, so we'll learn some interesting things. And then at the end, you will draw a picture and then show, tell me about it in a video so that I know what you learned about this new season. Okay, so it's called Goodbye Summer, Hello Autumn. And it's written and illustrated by Kennard Pock or Pack. All right, so let's see all the different things around us that are changing and notice what she sees and hears and feels. Hello, late summer morning. Hello, trees. Okay, so as the reader, now I'm gonna pay attention to what the trees say to this character. Hello, now that the cool winds have come, we love how our branches sway in the sun. Sway means move gently back and forth. So visualize that you can see the branches swaying in the illustration. So I just learned one thing, one clue that I might see with tree branches. As they sway, I might notice, oh, that's a clue that fall is coming. Hello, playful foxes and singing blue jays. Do you see the singing blue jays and playful foxes? Let's see what they tell her they're doing. Hello, we are busy looking for food. Some of us are heading south to our winter homes. Oh, so I just heard two things. I bet you did too. They said they're looking for food and I see them looking for food. And they said some of us are heading south to winter homes. That's where it's warmer. So some go to different places. I just learned two interesting new clues about foxes and birds. They're looking for food and some will leave. That's a clue that the fall is coming. Hello, walking sticks and butterflies. Look really closely to find these animals. Ooh, can you spot the butterfly? Hard to see because it reminds me of something. And here's the walking stick. Let's see what they tell her they're doing. Hello, we are surprised you saw us. We try our best to blend in and we'll do the same in warmer places. Oh, so they are also going to a warmer place. Interesting. And they try really hard to blend in. Tell someone if someone's with you or tell your own brain. What do, what do the butterflies look sort of like? What does the walking stick sort of look like? 
Mm. Okay, let's keep reading and notice what this character sees that tells her fall is coming. Hello, beavers. Hello, chipmunks. Here's a beaver. Can you spot another one oh, over here? There's some chipmunks. Let's see what the chipmunks and the beavers tell her they do to get ready for winter. Hello. We have no time to play because we're making cozy nests and dens. It will be cold soon and we want to get ready. Join with me as I close my eyes and tell myself what the beavers and the chipmunks are doing. Did you tell your own brain too? It says they're making cozy nests and dens. Hello, flowers. Hello. We are leaning into the sun, enjoying the last summer rays. Some of us, like asters and phlox, are late bloomers. We make the end of the season even more colorful. Oh, wow, these are very colorful flowers. And they're then leaning into the sun. Maybe that's what you want to draw your picture about to show fall is coming. Notice she even picked some. Hello, thunder. Ooh, something she hears. She's hearing that. It's another clue that fall is coming. Let's see what the thunder tells her. Hello, you can hear my low rumble from far away. My clouds loom over the open fields and quiet hills. Ooh, I bet you can imagine that loud rumble. And I bet you can picture and visualize the clouds too. Those are more clues that fall is coming. Hello, breezy wind. Mm, I bet you're also thinking about when you notice these things in nature. Hello, I love to whoosh, drizzle, and leaves through the misty streets. Hmm, look at, you can see the wind blowing these leaves. And look at this character's hat even. I bet you've noticed that clue that fall is coming sometimes with the breezy wind too. Hello, chill in the air. Let's see what the chill in the air tells her. Hello. It's time to bring out your thick sweaters and scarves. Can you see someone's thick sweater or scarf in the illustration? That's another clue that summer is gone and fall is here. Hello, puddle. Look at this puddle. Look at another one. Let's see what the puddles tell her. Hello. Now that the wind has come, I often get covered with fallen leaves. Notice that in the illustrations. I bet some of you have seen puddles that look like this in the fall. That's another clue that autumn or fall is here. Hello, leaves. Ooh, I already have an idea about what the leaves are gonna say just from the illustrations. I bet you do too. Let's listen and see what the leaves tell her. Hello, we are changing our colors. Some of us turn red or brown, while others turn gold or yellow. The dogwood leaves turn purple. Tell yourself, stop and tell yourself, tell your brain. What, what is happening to the leaves? What is a clue that fall or autumn is here? What clue does the, what, what do the leaves do? Hmm, maybe some of you want to do a picture about that. Hello, big orange sun. Ooh, I'm interested to see what the sun tells her. Hello, I am setting earlier and earlier now that summer is coming to an end, but I will see you again tomorrow. Hmm, maybe some of you have noticed that, that the sun is setting earlier and earlier darker earlier, huh? That's a really big clue that fall or autumn is here. Goodbye, summer. Looks like her, her um, nature walk is over. It looks dark out. 
look at this beautiful illustration that shows you fall things at nighttime. All right, boys and girls. Oh, and she says, hello, autumn. And we just started autumn or fall. That's our new season. So as the reader, your job was to notice the clues that this character saw on her nature walk. What were the things she saw or felt or heard that showed her that autumn or fall is coming? I'm gonna quickly remind you of these details by flashing you the photo or illustrations. Decide what you are most interested in. Can you include some of these in a picture? And tell me about the clues that this character saw or heard or felt. Ooh, maybe you want to share about what's happening with the foxes or the woodpeckers. Or maybe you were really interested in what was happening with the butterfly or the walking stick or the chipmunks and beavers. Ooh, or these beautiful fall flowers. Mmm, or that thunder or that breezy wind, or the chill in the air, or the puddles. There were some clues that the puddles said, things that happened to them that show us fall is coming or here. Or maybe you were really interested in the leaves or that big orange sun, what's happening with that sun in fall. So boys and girls draw a picture to show what you found interesting in this book. What were some of the things that happen when fall is here? And you can take a little video even to tell me about your picture, okay? So I can't wait to hear and see your smart thinking. Bye.